Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Laugh Out Loud with Tori. Ha! The vice chancellor was trending this weekend after she scolded a young woman for advertising her small business on her page. A whole page makeup, and today we've got Mabalani. Yes. How are you doing? I'm well, thanks. How are you? I'm great. So, Mabalani is a medium business owner who deals with a lot of makeup and all of that. Please tell us more. Of course, I am Mabalani, and I own a medium business. I'm a nail technician and a makeup artist. <laughs> you heard that makeup artist. She beats the face, not yes. literally, but with the brush. You Get got it? the point. <laughs> As you were sleeping, the vice chancellor insisted that people donate their money to charity instead of, you know, splurging it into small businesses. And just tweet to that. <laughs> what was happening there? Wow. <laughs> I can explain. Wow, at least your eyebrow was on point. Wow. <laughs> so, on point. Love it. <laughs> I can literally explain that I don't know what happened that day, but you know what? <laughs> We're not about that. And we've got a tweet from Yami Dish where she says, Hi, please support my small business, Nails 200 Red. Please retweet or book. I have open slots for the weekend. I'm based in Midlands. Hashtag go talk to that eight. Then we have Mamke Tipake where she says, So these nails cost 200 Red. I am now setting up an automatic 200 Rand monthly deposit to add Adopt Learner, which is my foundation that supports students who completed matric in township and rural schools to acquire higher education. This is a much better way to spend my money. Really? What's your take on this? Well, big ups to her. I believe that everyone has a talent. So, yes, she's helping people go to study and uh, go to school. But being a technician, you can also go to school to study that. So her helping that is a great idea. I support, but she shouldn't um, make it like mm. I don't have my business does not help the economy or doesn't help, mm. you know. See, if you support small businesses, why are you coming on the timeline and dragging one? Second, why are we classing alcohol, artificial nails, and weed in the same category? Like one of those is not like the other. Is this an odd one out or something? Now you're talking about, especially when one doesn't have excess cash. Who said anything about you must forego food to? buy 200 rand nails. No, that lady's business has a target market. The target market is people who can afford to spend 200 rand on their nails. And again, no one told you what you can spend your money on. If you don't want to get your nails done and you would rather donate to charity, do that. You don't have to call out a small business in the process. Remember guys, it's not all about the World War Three, a whole pandemic with you having to fight with the people on the Twitter. Do you know where the danger is? The danger is when you do the fight, <laughs> you could be on the hit list and you don't want to be hated by the Twitter <laughs> people. <laughs> Mama Lani, yes. it's been a pleasure to be with you. Where can the people find you? The people can find me on Instagram at Nails by Mavalani as well as on Twitter, Nails by Mavalani, as well as on TikTok, Nails by Mavalani. And there you have it. It's been a blast on Laugh Out Loud with Tori, the place to be. Till next time. <laughs>